Come on, I, I can't stop this thing. It doesn't have any brakes. All right, one thing I want to point out right here off the top. Unloading and cleaning up is a lot more fun after winning than it is after not winning. Although, do y'all realize this is three weeks in a row that we have won a race? Isn't it? Southern, Buckshot, True. Yeah. All Tech. Wow. Was that three weeks back to back to back back? I think it was. Yeah. Yeah. Nice yeah. 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 It's keep almost it like we're on a roll. Yeah. 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 Keep her rolling. Gotta keep it rolling. So Joseph gave her trophy away, which was cool. Y'all see that? Joseph gave it. But uh, I know where they keep the trophies. <laughs> so uh, anyway, we do have a trophy to show for our first 2024 Hunt the Front Super Dirt Series win. And a uh, kid at the track got a trophy as well. But we are coming off of the big win at All Tech with the Hunt the Front Super Dirt Series. Had a good weekend, a double header of racing at All Tech. Oh, man, we are getting unloaded and getting ready to clean up and go racing again. Do we get to put it on the wall or do we got to wait on Joseph to get back? I feel like everybody's tuned in wanting to see a check mounting on the wall ceremony. Well, here's the thing. I don't know where we're going to put it because he's fit to start getting into my territory and I'm just not <laughs> filling his face. You've left it open for him this whole time. <gasps> <laughs> There's a check from Saturday night made by Saturday Night Signs, by the way. Joseph is in Disney World still and... Um, you know, I think, I don't know that I want to wait a whole week to mount the check. I feel like that might be bad. We can't go back to the track not having mounted this. No. You know, and I don't know if Joseph's going to be back in time to do it. So I feel like we just need to go ahead and put the check on the wall. Hang it. Hang it. We could move yours over. Or I'll just take it home. Probably the only one I'll ever have. <laughs> I don't know what to do here. I don't know. Dusty, you got any? I mean, I kind of feel like the driver needs to hang his own check, right? Uh, or needs to be here for about. it. When will he be here? If he, We Those can't days. go. Okay. As long as he's here. I, I don't know if this in this video, if we're going to get to hang the check on the wall. But I can tell you this. We're not going back to the track this weekend without that being up there. Because I feel like that, that would end our streak. Yeah. You know what I mean? You can't do that. Mm -hmm. Anyway, so maybe, I don't know. We might not get to do that because I think we're going to wait on Joseph. No, stay tuned. You know, winning this weekend and not tearing anything up. Having a good weekend of racing was pretty cool. But there was something else really cool this weekend that uh, we haven't told them about yet. I know Joe's supposed to picture of it on Facebook, but we oh, didn't yeah. get it in a video yet. But we're really excited to tell y'all about our brand new car cover, race car, car cover from Canvas Crew. They were here uh, a few months ago at the shop measuring the car and they, uh, they have made us a car cover and they brought it to us at Alltech. And Jesse shot some video of it, so check this out uh, from Alltech when we got our new car cover from Canvas Crew. All right, so a while back ago, we got this fella and his buddy. Canvas Crew. Can oh, the Canvas Crew came by the shop and did some measuring and all that good stuff for a custom. Wait for it. Wait for it. Woo! Oh my gosh. That is awesome. A custom canvas that perfectly fits our race car and not only does it perfectly fit our race car it looks like our race car <laughs> am I right dude that is awesome hey man I think it turned out good I think it turned out good That's awesome so the, the canvas crew that's right hey where can they get one do a custom submission at uh, canvascrewgear.com there you go and you can get yourself a custom yeah hey no, not only do we have one of these we also have a crash cart cover oh a pit mat to lay down under the car and all kinds of and, and, and shock, shock covers. covers yeah dude that's awesome So anyway, that was pretty cool. Proud to have a, uh, a really nice car cover for this thing. I don't think we're gonna put it back on there. Um, Not today. You know, for, for, uh, for the video purposes, but y'all got to see it and I'm sure you all will see it some in the future at the track. Uh, but big thank you to the folks at the Canvas Crew. And if you're interested in getting uh, some, a cover for a car or a boat or 
whatever the case the info is in the description of the video where you can get in contact and find out more get back here hey i just realized something we have won every weekend since we got our new steering buddy our new white steering buddy that's the ticket. That's what, hey, that's what did it right there. Okay. Hadn't, haven't been, haven't gone racing yet since we got that and not one. I guess that means Joseph just needed help driving. Oh. Needed some help steering to get back to victory lane. Which one of those wins was Jesse? Because us in general. He just needed help driving to get to victory lane. That's all it was. Oh. Good. Get the other car out. I think we made a good call on which car to run this past weekend. Huh? You never know, we might have won them both if we'd have run this one. Just never gonna know. get the track what we use to watch our race cars we use proline from watertown the link is in the description where you can get your hands on some we use it for the boater and trailer the merch trailer race cars personal vehicles works great works on everything link is in the description where you can get it all right the car is cleaned up and we got the chicken Fifteen K baby. These <laughs> tires got it done. Got the got it done. Got the chicken. Our friends Donna and David from Tallahassee sent us uh I guess that's because we wanted all tech. We got the chicken. So they sent us the chicken. Anyway, the car's cleaned up and in the shop. These two will be sitting idle. The super late models will be sitting idle this weekend. We are going to go to Southern Raceway and Jesse's gonna do some more 604 racing uh, Saturday night. So local racing this weekend, our next super late model race will be Smoky Mountain. Smoky Mountain. We got a big back-to-back uh, -back weekend of Hunt the Front Super Dirt Series racing. The next round of the Hunt the Front Super Dirt Series, round four, will be Smoky Mountain April 27th, I believe is the date. And then we'll turn right around and go to ultimate in lancaster the very next weekend i believe that is may may 4th no may 3rd and 4th may 3rd and 4th will be ultimate, ultimate may 3rd no, lancaster lancaster may 4th you saying it correctly lancaster they'll correct you when we get up there if you're saying it wrong i say lancaster i don't think that's correct <laughs> anyway that'll be the next time that we're running the uh super late models taking and making sure that we're prepared for the next series race so i know a lot of y'all were hoping we'd be at talladega gonna be a big event up there this upcoming weekend with the world outlaws but we're not gonna make it to talladega we're making sure we're gearing up 100 percent ready to go for the hunt the front series races uh, so that the super late models will be sitting idle and we'll be going crate racing this weekend long story short there so these boxes tell me that we have our rack back. Mm -hmm. Rack back. We can give Bo his yeah, rack so back. We might need to keep it for a spare though. Yeah, I want to remember. Bo uh -huh. borrowed our rear end. Right. And so he returned the favor by yeah. letting Jesse borrow a rack. Yeah. Which he probably doesn't even need anymore because he doesn't have the capitals anymore. Probably not. But we might just need to buy it from but him. But it's better that before I go here to Milton and kill his rack, mm -hmm. we should give it back to him. Probably. Good idea. So we got if y'all remember from the last time Jesse raced. Uh, we were having, we were reusing our spare rack because Jesse had torn up the, the rack that was on this car when they all piled up in front of him at Southern. Well, that rack has been fixed and is back, so we got to swap and get Bose off of here 
and yep. put our fresh ready to go rack on here. Is that is that something that is correct. Okay. We gotta do a rack swap. A rack swap. So what we're looking at here is we gotta unhook the steering shaft, both tie rods. We got how many lines we got on? Two lines, two power steering lines, and then three and then three bolts that actually hold the rack on the cross member. There we go. Now we got that out lay right there. Hey, you gonna get your new shirt dirty? Hey, before you do. That gummit. You're right. <laughs> There's our new shirt. Brand new, available now on the website. And just we. I'm well on my way to ruin. Jesse it. had to put this on the model for the pictures. You want to put your other? I'm taking it. All right, there's the shirt. The brand new shirt. HDFmerch.com is where you can get it. While we're on the subject, we also, for the first time in quite a while, have visors in camouflage visors also brand new and available now at htfmerch.com yeah 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 dude one of the scariest moments i ever had in a race car when the steering shaft came when off. that steering shaft came off i remember scared that. the crap out of me all the more reason to make sure you get it back on good and tight and then put the other one on uh -huh. all right now you got to get the get the rest of the layoff by get pulling the rack forward and off. All right, all right, all right. Now just whatever you got to do to wiggle it out. That belongs to Bo. This is Bo's. Okay, we need to clean that up and get it back to him. Mm -hmm. Does it have the same servo and all on it? Actually, no. Bo's is uh, at the right. Where is it? It's going to be right. That's it. Right Two, fi 235. And I think this is a 240. Oh. The higher the, the, higher number, the number, the stiffer the rack. Right. This more force feedback. Right. right. Yeah. In yeah. Racing, yeah. In yeah. eye racing terms. Yeah. yeah. So the when, the servo, the more force when Jesse back. first got into the late models, he had too light, too low of a number, and so we put him a stiffer one in to yeah, slow you know slow his hands down. This other, let's see what our backup was. I thought all our stuff was two thirty fives. We had a two. All right, so that's no, one, that's a two twenty backup. That's the one that we pulled off. Yeah, this is this okay, is well, actually it's our actually not a good spare. No, it says it, good spare on it. It is actually not that one we got to send off. This one just came back. That one's going back to boat. This one's boat. Don't get them mixed up. Also, don't let me cut you. <laughs> I'm just like, why are you leaving that thing? What does it have on it? Dang, two thirty five. Oh, you want to go? Well, two twenty is what you had way back. Yeah. That was too light, but you're also kind of a small feller. Small feller. Uh, I think 235 is where you need to be. 235. So our spares are 220. The one that came off the guard is 235. Mm-hmm. And Bose is a 235. I bet there all the ghosts are 235s as well. Sure is pretty. Let me go look. Just got curious. 235. Yeah, he's got 235. So. That might be the only 220 we got. You know you, they can put different servos on them, so when we send that other one off, the one that's the spare that's not good, we could get a 235 put on it. Yeah, and have all the That way it's all the same. Yeah. Oh, that's what they replaced. What is that? That's probably what they replaced. What's it say right there? This is bent. Multiple high spots. I don't know. So, I guess that's what the inside of a rack looks yeah, like. Yeah, I'm assuming yeah. there's a brand new of both of them. Yeah. Uh-huh. I'm assuming they put those new in whichever one, the new one, the fresh one. Is that how that works? Yep. Heck, if I don't know. <laughs> don't get me to lie to you. <laughs> Dude, that's probably the hard spot. Oh, one right in, there. One, it's nicked. Okay. That was our problem. Yep. So that wreck when... They piled up and Jesse hit, hit one of them and flipped them. Right it's that it did that to a rat. Okay. Alright, now hold, hold on, let me get this chest on. This has to go under. There we go. Right there. 
Oh yeah, there you go. Now, nice. there you go. Left. Hold on, says he. Don't come way left. Come on, come on, come on. Well. Oh yeah. We got our ride height sticks and our toe. We call these. Toe checking. I don't know. I, uh, toe checking. Yeah. Sounds good. <laughs> sounds good to toe checkers. toe checkers. And our tape. Read the verdict, Dusty. And our right. tape reader. Ready to do the math. Hope you remember your fractions. Look good? It's good. All right. Crank it up and then work the wheel. We got power steering. Yep. Yep. Power turning fluid in it. All right. It's got power steering fluid in it. Lines are hooked up. Bolts are tight. Tie rod bolts are tight. Did you tighten the shaft? Shaft is good. Okay, so we're gonna crank it up, work the wheel back and forth, and make sure the power turning works. Exactly. Make sure everything works like it ready? should. I'm ready. All right, now I'm ready. Jesse's got his rack back. You got tired of the cheetah hanging out or leopard hanging out? He's gonna hang out in the car. <laughs> this car will be at Southern Raceway Saturday night. Jesse will be driving. Uh, not sure if it'll be live anywhere, but we will have a video next week from our night at Southern. Then we'll be back in action with the Supers at Smoky Mountain with the Hunt the Front Super Dirt Series uh, next week. Don't forget about the new merch, htfmerch.com and the Canvas Crew. If you're interested in getting more information uh, on that, the link is in the description of the video for that. Thank y'all for watching this video. Like, comment, subscribe. We will see y'all later.